What's up everybody? I just got done getting these boxes open. I've got my new Mapex Black Panther Persuader in the mail. This is by far the most expensive snare that I've got so far, but I'm not paying for it all at once. I'm doing a payment plan because, uh, you know, screw that. I'm not going to pay that much for a snare right off the rip. I don't have that kind of money. It's about $580, but with tax and everything, I believe it's a little over $600. So <clears throat> this is what it comes in. It has this little fancy bag. It's pretty cool. If I want to travel with it or something, you can take it somewhere. You got this bag, so that's gnarly. Got a lot of snares, and this is going to be my main snare because it's by far, like I said, the most expensive snare that I bought. I think before this, the most I paid for a snare was around a couple hundred bucks, maybe. But um, it's not really about the money always. If you like the sound of a snare, then that's really all that's important. But um, I did want to upgrade to a a main snare if you will and um i really like my piccolo snare though my pearl piccolo it was only like 150 bucks and you get a lot of value out of that i think i don't got my tripod on me so uh hold up looks like leo likes this it's called a black panther and i got my black panther here what's up leo He always likes when I get boxes. But yeah, I'm going to try to get this bag open real quick. It's kind of knotted, so give me one second. I'll just set this here. Leo is sniffing the phone. Knock it over, buddy. All right. Let's see. There we go. All right. Getting it out now. Maybe. The sucker is a big snare. I'll get into some details about what it is in a minute. It smells good. It has like a strong metal scent to it. Metal is metal. Yeah, I'm having a little bit of trouble, y'all. One second. I'm not so sure I like this bag after all. It's not coming out so easily. Ow. This thing weighs a lot too. It's got some weight on it. It's looking nice right out. I've got it about halfway off. That's what she said. All right, cool. I got it. That bag was awfully tight. It did not want to come out of there. So, here it is out of the bag. It's got a Remo Ambassador head on it. So, it doesn't come with a cheapie, comes with an actual good head, which is kind of crazy because I didn't really expect that. I actually ordered a um, Evans, Evans coated dry snare head in the mail, so I don't know if I'll put it on here. I might actually put that on one of my other snares that need it, but um, <clears throat> excuse me. Yeah, this is a uh, first look. Check it out. It is 14 by 6.5. It's a hammered brass snare shell. And what that means is, if you look at the sides here, it has all these, these like, uh, these dents from the hammer where when they make it, they actually hammer it because it gives it uh, more of a uh, diverse sound to it. You know what I mean? Like, um, it's not just a loud metal snare. You can play it at different, different levels. If you hit it hard, it'll sound really hard and so on. I watched some videos on it, so it looks like it has some nice wires on it, too. I don't think I'll be swapping those out. I have to count how many is there, though. There's that little Black Panther logo. I was actually going to get um, another Yamaha snare, a, a maple a maple Yamaha Tour Custom. But I ended up getting this instead with a payment plan because uh like i said i'm not gonna pay for it right out i don't have a drumstick on me or i would hit this right now but uh yeah i'm just showing you guys what it looks like there's the box really cool packaging i ain't gonna lie that's that's the coolest packaging i've probably got so far out of any of my drums snares 
This came in a day. I literally ordered this uh, yesterday on Zounds. And uh, this bad boy shipped super quick. Like, that that's the fastest I think I've ever gotten a drum in the mail. I, I got a cymbal in a day, but I've never got a drum that quick. So, that is pretty fresh. I'm just going to tap on this real quick and see how it sounds. Oh, it needs tuned. It's completely loose. So, I'm going to have to tune that. I'm not going to do that on this video because I'm not even in my drum room. I'm just in my bedroom right now my cat my tv and stuff but um yeah i don't have this in the drum room yet so i was just gonna unbox it show you guys what it looks like uh my first thoughts you know it's not always about looks anyways but i really want it to sound good but it does look pretty cool it's definitely different than any of the snares i own i've never had a hammered shell like this metal shell it says it's um it's got like antique, antique, um, shit, what was it? Antique copper or something? I don't know. It's made of some fancy shit. That's all I can tell you. Let me see if it's on here. Mm, anyways, yeah, I don't know. It looks badass though. I'm really excited to uh, get this tuned up and see how it sounds with the rest of the kit I got in there. So yeah, that's it. I do like this bag too. I'm not going to keep it in this bag, but if I ever take it anywhere, this bag is definitely fresh. But yeah. <clears throat> Be watching out for uh, a video on this when I actually get it put to work because I think it's going to sound pretty badass. Alright, I'm out. Peace.